BC is a right triangle and AC equals 1, then BC equals the square root of 3 and AB equals 2. This also means that BA equals DB and BD equals 2. And since triangle BAD is an isosceles triangle, it also follows that its base angles are equal. So BDA equals BAD. Therefore, BDA Teacher! Is... Yes. Corona's got a hard on. <laughs> oh, 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 man, you're such a hard dog. Is making it with a girl the only thing you think about? Ha uh ha. -huh. Shut your whole fucking cow. It's true. You just wish I did. Oh. Then stand up and prove you don't. All right, class, that's enough. Settle down. And as for you... Uh, yes, ma'am? Let's phone up on math here and save that for when you get home. God, can't you sleep somewhere else, you stinking bum? Oh, oh, baby, you were made to make me... Come back here! Damn, that's the third time this has happened now. That little bastard. Keep an eye on the store, honey. Come back here, you! Third time's the charm. Isn't the train ever going to stop? What the? 2,300 yen and no bush? What a rip! Damn. His office closes at five. He's going to lock himself in there and hide. I know it. What'll I do? At this rate, my husband will get home before I do. He'll kill me. Come on. I don't believe this crap. I'm supposed to score tonight. This is so not fair. If I don't meet him soon, Ryosuke will go home and I won't get laid. God, this sucks. Please excuse me, young man, but could I ask you something? Is this the right platform for the train to Hanodadai? Oh, why'd you have to ask me, Grandma? You're in the wrong place, but explaining where to go will be such a pain. Yeah, that's right. Thank you so much for your help, young man. Oh, jeez, that wino. You get a job and take a bath. Come on, go! I'd better make sure I'm not stuck in the same car. That smell. Goddamn. Bamboozing in the middle of the day. Not a care in the world. Ain't that a kick in the head? Man, does he stink. Keep out of my way or I'll shove your ass onto the tracks. Just what are you looking at? I wasn't put here for your amusement. Young yeah, man, I hate to bother you, but this seems to be the wrong platform. Well, in that case, maybe you should have tried to figure it out for yourself instead of relying on a complete stranger to do it for you. Well, I apologize then. Sorry, Granny. I may look nice, but I've learned that most people just aren't worth my time. Like those two. I bet they've never had a single deep thought between them. And those girls are even worse. Empty-headed cock teasers and social climbers. Hmm. And the further I stay away from someone like him, the better. And that one's not even worth wasting the brain cells on. Ugh. Hey, wait. hasn't changed that much since we were in grade school, but I heard he turned into a real punk after he switched schools. I bet he doesn't even remember me, though, even if we did always play together. Look at him now. Talk about your total thug. Hey, somebody fell on the tracks. What happened to him? He was staggering and fell. Come on, man. Get up. Oh, man. You're in for it now, you poor drunk bastard. The station attendant's not coming, and no one else is going to risk their life to save your sorry ass. Everything's wet from the rain. He must have slipped. Will somebody just call the station attendant? Someone help him. Oh, he's a lost cause. Wow, right I've never along. seen someone fall on the tracks before. Oh, I've got a text message for Yosuke. Sure, helping him would be the humane thing to do. But someone else will step up. Sure they will. I've got a mortgage to pay. But if no one helps him... Then we'll all need a real dead body. Getting ripped to pieces. I've never seen someone get torn apart except in movies. And look at Kato. Even a tough snot like him's getting freaked out. But come to think 
think of it, he was always kind of squeamish back in the day. Fine, that does it! Huh? Oh, what the fuck? Are you out of your mind? This is no time to be acting like a hero, you idiot. What are you trying to prove? That you can do it by yourself? Uh, that kid jumped on the tracks. He's gonna get himself killed. Wow, now both of them can get ripped to shreds. Mm. He's kind of cute. Nice ass. Uh, hey, you gotta get up. Uh, Will someone up there please come down and give me a hand? Where the hell is the station attendant? Didn't someone get him already? I think someone went. He should be here any second. Don't just stand there. You can't just watch us die. Give me a break. He's just a bum. Leave him. No one's gonna help you, you stupid punk. Get real, Kato. You're the one who's being crazy here. Is that? Oh, now you remember. You don't really think that I'll... K. Corona! Shit. Oh, this is so not fair. And what are all of you staring at me for? One of you go! What are you waiting for? Get going! Go on! He's your friend! Come on! Hurry up! Fuck! 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 What am I doing down here? Why in the hell am I doing this? Are you happy he remembers you now, you fucking idiot? Okay, bend down. What? Under him, for leverage. Great. Looks like I don't have to go down there. You just signed your death sentences, kids. Uh, oh, jeez, does he reek? This isn't looking good. Oh, Hurry up, hell? damn it! Oh, oh, where the hell's the station attendant? The next train will be arriving at platform two. Please stand behind the yellow them up. line. I know, I know, damn it! But I feel so sick! What are you doing? Hurry up! He's too heavy! Push, Cotto! That's what I'm doing! Stand up! Oh, shit! The train's coming! I think I'm gonna puke! Come on, you two! Climb up, now! Okay, start running. Run? But that's a train! Oh, God, we're fucked! Train starts slowing down as it reaches the station. If we run, we can make it past where the first car stops. Oh, yeah. I didn't think of that. Good luck. We've still got a chance. We can make it, but... Kato, lose the bag. What? Drop your stuff. I've got to keep the umbrella. Huh? Are you out of your mind? It's for my kid's brother. He went to school without one. Oh, for... Then at least lose the stupid bag. If you don't outrun the train, your brother will get that umbrella at your goddamn funeral. All right already. The express train for Hinodadai will be passing shortly. For your safety, please stay behind the yellow line. An express? But only local trains stop at this station! I don't believe this! I'm gonna die and the last thing I did was buy a girly mag! I swear I'll get you your umbrella, little brother. Kay, are you alright back there? Of course not! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm so fucking scared and... An opening! Look for an opening! There's gotta be one! There's nothing, damn it! Oh, that's good. No, wait! I gotta get a picture of this! Did you two almost die too? With us. What the hell is going on here? 
I don't know, but somehow or other we made it out alive. Look! Made it? Made it where? None of us made it. Oh, just shut up! This place is heaven, and we're all here because we're dead. Speak for yourself. We're not all senile, Gramps. <laughs> well, I suppose that is one possible theory, but... All I know is that I was lying in a hospital bed dying of cancer, and then I was here and the pain's completely gone. How else would you explain that? Dead? That can't be. My heart's still beating, and I'm breathing too. Wait. Hold on. If we're dead, why is the Tokyo Tower out that window? You're right. We're in Tokyo. Uh, hey, why can't I touch the latch? What do you mean you can't touch it? What the heck? What's going on? It's pointless. We've all tried and we can't touch the doors or even the walls. If we could, we wouldn't still be sitting in this room. Even our cell phones are blocked. Please tell me you're kidding. Did you try making noise or something to get the neighbor's attention? Yes, but there was no response. <laughs> the front door's no good either. I don't see anything. Where did you say the bodies were? Over there somewhere. There isn't any sign of blood either. But I saw their heads fly clean off. I know, I took pictures of their heads flying off, but for some reason they're, they're not here. Yeah, well, their heads may be gone, but their school bags are still here. This bag? Excuse me, everyone. May I suggest that we all introduce ourselves? Names and what you do first, oh, and get then how you die. You sound like you're teaching kindergarten here. Well, I teach first grade, actually. Oh. I'll go first. <clears throat> I'm Masashi Yamada. I teach at Narima Higashi Elementary School, and I had an accident while riding my scooter. Um, so how about you? Huh? Damn it! Why did you have to pick me first? K, high school student. And I'm dead. Even though I don't think I'm actually dead. Because of this jerk. That's right, it's your fault. Yeah, and I'm so sorry, Kay. I guess I just naturally assumed that you'd want to help. Right, as if. And you are? Oh, yeah. Masaru Kato, hit by a train. Hit by a train? It tore us to ribbons. Are you even sorry for getting me killed, Mr. Hero? You make me sick. Hey. I think I know this guy. Well, your turn. Goro Suzuki. Yeah, he's a politician or something on TV. You've probably heard of me. <laughs> yeah, right. And you. Dude, I told you, not playing. Pass. Oh, sure. Make me look like an idiot for going along with this crap. Introduce yourself, you ass. Hey, anyone got any smokes? And I bet you smoke like a girl, too. I'm Joichiro Nishi, 8th grade, and I fell. What a freak. And why are you staring at me, you little psycho? Okay, no one's got any cigarettes then? All right, good. And, um, next? Um, please, sir? He's a Yakuza. Like me. No more questions. Oh, okay. Is that everyone? I guess so. Okay, there's something different about you. Yeah? Besides being dead like you, you mean? The K I remember had more of an edge. Back when we were kids, I didn't think there was anything you were afraid of. That's why we thought of you as our leader. Me? Your leader? Oh man, when was that? Either you're laying it on thick or my memory is fucked. What caused that change? Well, you've changed a lot too. Yes, but remember those games of tag we used to play? Yeah. Whether you were running away or chasing us, you were so fast, it was amazing. I remember how you jumped down a whole flight of stairs. Okay, enough! Oh, and there was one time, it was totally awesome. I don't remember exactly why, but all the tough kids from school had you cornered. And you just jumped off the overpass and landed on the roof of a passing truck. It just blew me away. And I remember thinking, I want to be like him. So... When my grades went south and I got sent to the school with all the hoods and punks, I patterned everything I did after you. Oh, give me a break. Are you trying to tell me it's my fault you turned out like this? 
Huh? Kay, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Uh, what the fuck? I don't believe it. Here comes another one. Yeah, looks like a girl. Is how we got oh. here? Oh. Hey, is she? Not now! Oh, jeez, I will not get a stiffy. I will. Oh, fuck! <laughs> Ooh, yeah, these coochie shots are all going up on my webpage. <laughs> hey, hey, what do you think you're doing? You're blocking my view! Uh, excuse me, but I don't think you should be doing that. <laughs> but I. Just, you're just what, peckerhead? Hey, she's bleeding. But there aren't any cuts on her wrists. Do you see this, Kay? A suicide. In the bathtub, I guess. Is she alive? Yeah, I can hear her heartbeat. Um, you know, you could have checked her pulse at the wrist. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so stop playing musical crotch with her, you sleaze. What? Why can't she? I mean, couldn't we just... She's dreaming? I know I do. You stay here. All of stay you. Stay here? But... Oh, hell. Don't tell me you're gonna... Huh. Holy shit. That guy, something else, huh? <gasps> hey, you did have cigarettes. I should help her, but what's the point? Who in the hell could go up against that monster? No! Uh, oh, no way! His friend's right over there! No! That's not a good idea. It's hard to find such a brave young man these days. Hey, I don't see you helping her. Because that Yakuza would kick my pants if do that. All right!
It says that your lives are now over, and what you do with your new lives is for me to decide, so there you have it. Hey, what the? Is this thing trying to screw with us? It may sound screwy, but if you stop to think about everything that's already happened to us, it's not all that funny, is it? Uh-huh. Please go eliminate this target now, you bastards. The green onion alien. Traits, strong, smelly, likes green onions, friendship. Catchphrase, green onions are enough for me. <laughs> what the hell is this? I think this is some kind of game. Does this mean it's going to let us out? <laughs> yeah, baby! <laughs> Check these out! They look real! Woohoo! Oh, someone's in there! Well, I heard of being behind the eight ball, but inside it? Oh. I'll give it up already. It's probably just a dummy to fake you out. I don't know. For a fake, it looks pretty real. Kato Cha? Bad spelling or a pun? Kato, I think this might be for you. Wasn't there a singer called that? Cosplay? Final! Cool! Here, you try it on. Oh, screw you. taken the others, do you think? Huh? You mean it's happening to me too? But it doesn't... Ah! Huh? Wait! Uh, I'm outside. Why the fuck? Uh, oh, holy shit! But can I... Yeah, come on, come on! Uh, oh shit, it's too tight! Right, move the boxers! Yeah! Uh, huh? This is definitely not good. Oh, there it is. Just in time. So what were you up to with your dingle dangle and short stuff? <laughs> hey, you didn't. Huh? Hey, it's not what you think. Hey, butter dog. chance to turn things around. All I need is a chance to mop the floor with that cocky little prime minister. I know what I need. I'll hit a parlor in Soapland and get the plumbing scrubbed. Man, I just wish these were real guns. I'll tell you one thing. I'm gonna do that bitch. I'm so glad we get to go home after this. I've still got all those tests to grade. Hold on! Before we go any further, it is my duty to tell you that unbeknownst to most humans, there are alien criminals secretly living here on Earth. We have all been recruited by a secret government organization, and now it's our job to get rid of these aliens! What the fuck are you talking about? Aw, oh, dude, you're so full of it. You mean, like the Greys and stuff? Sonny, the current government doesn't have that kind of money. And I should know. 
Then go ahead and doubt me, Grandpa. But for each one we kill, we get 10 million yen. Damn. Whoa, no kidding? You believe him, Kay? Oh, well, I... You've got to be pulling our legs. Nope, I got it straight from my dad at the Cabinet Information Bureau. Then your father's Vice Minister Nishi? Who? Nishi's one of the top dogs in the Information Bureau. They say he's as sharp as a knife, and that he never tells a lie. And that's how come I know so much about this stuff, Four Eyes. Shit. Ten million. That kind of do goodbye. Well, if you're interested, it's all in here. Oh. Hey, if that's us, it's right down the street! Ten million, huh? Now just hold on. How can this be? Because, old man, the Bureau's never told you politicians the truth about anything. You're just for show, a pawn. And whether you like it or not, you've all been recruited for this recruited little Recruited by who? It's funny how I don't remember any of that. Have you forgotten? That stranger that asked you for something? <sighs> oh, and all we've got is one hour! Let's go! Oh, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, let's go! go. This is nonsense. Yeah, yeah. I'm going home. Well, Kay, now what? Huh? Uh, well, uh... Is he over there? I thought this was the right place! He's not but... here, you dumb fucks! You know, if you're fucking with us, I'm gonna kill you. Oh, I'm scared. Except I'm already dead, asshole. Ichinomiya? Damn, I can't go home dressed like this. Oh yeah, she is definitely my type. And going home without doing something about it would be a shame. Um, what's going on here? Huh? What do you mean? What do you She's mean? Got what do you mean? You voice. mean that you don't know either? Well, I thought we were going home, right? Wait, uh, hold on a second. You can have my pants, too. No, no, please keep your pants on. I just want to know what we're going to do next. And maybe your names? I'm Kay, Kurono. Kurono, right. And you are? Huh? Oh, I'm Masaro Kato. Uh, Mr. Kato, I... <laughs> just Kato's fine. Why are I you cozying up to him? Hey, maybe someone should find the others. You mean you're not going to stay with us? No, it's just... Yeah, I've got the same feeling. Why is she following him? Plus, give me two. Do we plug him or plant him? Yes, two. Ah, oh, God! Why are you sorry, little... Oh, yeah, let's see if this is how to fire it. Just give me two. You've got two guns, Nicholas? Give me one. And one over, Cozy Locks. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Huh? 
Are you all right? Uh, 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 wait, I don't think you should be moving. Uh, Just give me the uh, uh, Hey, come back! Yeah. Get away. Don't let him get away! Come on, let's go! <laughs> Does it mean that we really are dead? Cut off! Cut off! Why does it have to be like this? from this. You're smoked. Hey, just how do you shoot one of these things? Well, I see that they have two triggers. And yeah, I got mine to fire when I pull both at the same time. Forgive them because you're cute, but are you all totally insane? 
You sick, sadistic bastards! How could you? How could you? We've got to call an ambulance or something! So you having problems with this hero? That's right, and it felt good to off the little onion sucking freak. Dear God, forgive me. I couldn't save them. I couldn't. Oh, spare us, you poser! That, that thing wasn't even human! And what difference does that make? So, what do we do about that? Oh, shit! Someone saw us! Huh? Help! Call the police! Huh? Hey, Mom! What are you doing? The Saito house is all messed up!
Is he dead? What we hit? There isn't anything there. Freaky. Come on, let's get out of here. Yeah, maybe we ran over a cat or something. Uh, hey, watch it! What's your problem? Uh, look, could you guys maybe let us borrow a cell phone or something? <laughs> hey, what's wrong? I think there's something standing here. Uh, dude, what in the world are you talking about? There's something invisible. <laughs> sent to the school with all the hoods and punks, I patterned everything I did after you. Huh? 
Just two or three broken bones, I'll be lucky. Oh, wait, I'm already dead.
was all our fault to begin with anyway. What? I can't hear you. still running, I'll let you score the points this time. But that's all you'll get. Now take that gun of yours and finish it. Uh, what? You want me to shoot him with this? That's right, with that. And if I do, what then? You'll see. Just do it. Pull both triggers. But... If I shoot him with this, won't he? Well, that's the idea. To kill him. After all that's happened, I bet you'd love to see him die, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? He had no problem killing the others, right? Including your boyfriend over there. Just look. No! I 
Do not! You lie, and don't compare me to you. All that's different is that you're in denial. Just another hypocrite. A hypocrite? I'm not sure what you mean. But I sure as hell don't want someone like you calling me that, you sick little freak! I guess you're not as smart as I thought you were. What a disappointment. At least my view of the world didn't come out of comic books and video games. You're living in a fantasy! You just don't get it, do you? If I were like that, I wouldn't have survived in this world for as long as I have. What does that mean? Oh, uh, nothing. Oh yeah, play dumb again! That's what you do whenever something's important, isn't it? Not really. Okay. To prove that I'm not caught up in that stupid fantasy crap, let's talk about something that's real. Just... What do you mean by real? For example, let's say that there's someone about to die right before your eyes. Someone who there's no point in even trying to rescue because they're going to die at any moment. That's something that we could all witness in our everyday lives, right? Perhaps in something like a horrible traffic or train accident. <laughs> now, in that situation, what's the first thing you think of? That you've got to find a way to rescue them? Yeah, right! Your first thought is, I might be able to see someone die today. And it's not just freaks who think that way. It's everybody. It doesn't matter whether it's a plane crash or a war. When you see that stuff on the news, your heart is pounding, isn't it? Why is it, I wonder, that the news program's ratings always go up when they run stories like that? It's because it's just human nature. They're all secretly hoping they'll get a chance to see a dead body. It's an excitement that defies all logic. You sick! A sick little freak! Like I care. You see, when I jumped, I realized that it's all the same in the end. <sighs> this is the way it's gotta be. You know I'm right, don't you? In the end, even death is no big deal. And I'm perfectly fine with that. Sure you are. But you're only able to talk so tough because you're still alive! And what makes you think we're alive? <laughs> It just doesn't make a difference. I really was going to let you score the points for shooting him, you know. Oh well. Whatever. <laughs> Strangely beautiful, don't you think? This is what death is like. The gun that transports them is the gun that kills them. Transports them? But where? Where? Somewhere there. So, you know all about this. Well, I don't know everything, but I know more than you. Oh, do you? So what's next? First, we return to the room. And then what? Then you're free to go. You can even go home if you like. Yeah, we can go home? You mean, we're not really dead? No, we're alive. Just wait, you'll see. We can go home? We can really go home? I didn't... <laughs> no! Kato! Hold on, please! Kato! Nishi! We were brought back once! Can't we? I'm sorry, but only those who are still alive at the end of the mission can return to the room. But uh, what if he's not not dead yet? Kato! Kato! Kato, please. Did you hear him? We can go home. It's over. God, listen to her. Kato. And this is a girl who puked on me. Hey, he's a lost cause. No, he's not! Actually, the sad thing is it doesn't matter how badly your body's been hurt if you survive the game. If you make it back alive, it's all fixed. Yeah, right. Fine, then. You don't have to believe me. Please, Kato, get up! Come on, Kato! Wake up! See you around. Damn it! Come on, Kato! Hang in there! Kato! Kato! Come on! Kato! 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 We 
we can all go back together. Kato! Kato! Kato, please! Kato! 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 did pretty good. It's been a long time since anyone besides me made it back here alive. Hey, we made it back, so show us our scores. You're ignoring me? Dog? Oh, yeah, he always comes back as well. The useless little sack of shit. It's about time. Gans is going to give us our scores now. Huh? What's Gans? And it's giving us what? So the sphere's name is Gans. Did you give it that name? Nah, it's always been Gans. And you know this because... Because that's what the ones before me called it. about the situation. Then why do you know so much? Exactly who in the hell are you? Why? Well, I'm an alien. <sighs> You're full of it. <laughs> it. 
Yes, you're right. Why, you? The truth is, I'm just an ordinary middle school student. I first came to this room a year ago. Don't you see? Come on, use your imagination. The truth is that I don't know when this was all started, but I've had to live through many nights like this. And long before I came here, this room was bringing people together a few at a time. People who should have been dead by all accounts. And if they happen to die during the course of a mission, it brings in others to replace them. In the years since my first game, I've seen dozens like you die. I've seen people die in the most spectacular ways. While I've managed to survive through it all. Oh, Gantz, show them all the people who've died. Hey, Gantz, listen to me when I'm talking to you. Okay, look at the bottom row. Do you see them? Those are the guys who died tonight. They were a particularly dumb bunch, of course. But you, fortunately, were different from them. You realized the importance of the suit as if by instinct, and that's why you survived. It's his calmness that pisses me off. Is he really So still why the... didn't you tell us? If you had explained all of this at the beginning, then more of us might have survived. In fact, you intentionally fed us a story that was completely false. Yeah. He has a point. Why didn't you tell us what was going on? Yeah, why didn't you? I want answers. Because I knew that while they were dying, the target would drop its guard. <gasps> Monster! Those were human beings who got killed! How could you just stand by and watch? Hey! It's not my problem whether they live or die. I know what you're thinking. You really want to hit me, don't you? God, you reek of hypocrisy! Out of the three of you, you're the worst! You're a hypocrite! Hypocrite! Go on, Kato! Smash his snotty little face in! Kick his ass! Oh, come on. You guys really are complete and total idiots. And you just don't get it, do you? The fact is that I'm the strongest one here. Ah! I'm just gluing you in out of the goodness of my heart. And this is the way you decide to treat me? Don't you think there's something very wrong with that scenario? Maybe I should crush your arm. That way you'll know who to follow. Let him go now! Hey, don't! Let go of him, please! If you shoot. It'll be your head that explodes. Okay, then. How about this? An arm for an arm. Next question. A while ago, you said that we were alive. But if we're alive, then why couldn't anyone see us? Or anything that we did? It was like we were ghosts. So I'm gonna ask you once more. Are we really alive? Yes, we are. You're not shitting us. The people who come here were rescued just moments before they were supposed to die. Is that what you want me to say? Is it true? It could be. The way I see it, there was a person, an original. But that original really is dead. And everyone who comes to this room comes out of something like a human fax machine. And the originals, are they? Oh, and when you go home, you shouldn't talk to anybody about this. He's gone! <laughs> they wouldn't believe you anyway. Hi, Mom. Money? Oh, no, I'm fine. Uh, what? No, it's nothing. And now, Mr. 
this morning's news. A 40-year-old woman gives birth via cesarean section but dies from shock and loss of blood. More on this later. Was it just a dream? There's no way it could have been real. In other news, a member of the lower house of parliament died last night in a Tokyo hospital. Goro Suzuki was a veteran member of parliament, five times elected to the lower house. Since the end of last year, he'd been hospitalized for liver cancer. A date for the special election to replace Mr. Suzuki's parliamentary seat has not yet been announced. Next, late last night, at the intersection of the Ume Highway in Loop 8, a tragic collision between a scooter and a compact car left a local teacher dead. Masashi Yamada, an elementary school teacher, was killed instantly.
special collection. <laughs> well, that's a dentist's son for you. Hey, Dr. Vanna, just how many teeth do you got there? Oh, these are just my favorites. I've got about a hundred at home. <gasps> what a monster. <laughs> know something else? This one's a little wobbly, too. Come on, enjoy your brother. He's fucking ruthless. How can this guy be real? <laughs> All right, then. The 10th grader can bring me 100,000 yen tomorrow. You got that? 100,000? You gotta be shitting me. No one's got that kind of money. This is just fucking crazy. But what am I gonna do? I can't fight this guy. Just look at him. Look at him. No. I won't pay you. No! Just when I thought... I had my old life back. Why does this have to happen? Why? We're coming to you live from the scene of the incident. We have yet to learn the whereabouts of the two missing high school boys, but we have found this. This adult magazine was found on the platform, and it was reportedly dropped by one of the two boys. Oh, talk about embarrassing. But mayonnaise still tastes like mayonnaise. Bread still tastes like bread. Even milk tastes the same. a person but the original really is dead and everyone who comes to this room comes out of something like a human fax machine huh and when you go home you shouldn't talk to anyone about this they wouldn't believe you anyway hold on faxes what does that mean i mean we're all copies But you know, Gantz can be pretty sloppy sometimes. One poor guy found his original still alive when he got home. But, oh well. He vanished. Now that I think about it, I suppose I'll just have to kill one of you. Just kidding! <laughs> You should have seen your faces. Oh, but seriously, you shouldn't speak to anyone about this, or your head will go boom! Did he just... Hot damn, the door's still open! Side. Yeah, so can we really go home now? Uh, uh, hey, um, okay. Could you maybe let her borrow those clothes? Huh? Why? Huh? Oh, oh, yeah. Here, from me to you. I don't know what to say. I guess we just look a little weird to him. We're going home. And yet, just minutes ago, we were... I'd rather not think about that right now. Yeah, me neither. Well, thanks for letting me borrow your clothes.
What's your name? Oh man, why are you blushing like that? My name's Kay. Kay Kishimoto. Why do you look so happy? He just asked your name! Huh? Kay? Oh man, you mean we've got the same name? Damn, she had some nice tits. Man, just like that should be outlawed. I mean, they're just wrong. Hey, you like a pig, don't you? Not like you do. Hey, did you see the new anime that started on the BS last night? I bet it's gonna be totally huge. Even if I tried to tell them about yesterday. Hey, uh, Corono? Huh? Uh, I'm kind of in a bind right now. With what? Well, you know that 11th grader, Yonakura? He's been hitting me up for money. Yeah, and? I can't even afford my anime magazines. Do I look like I care? <gasps> What's up? It's your good pal, Mr. Yonakura. How you doing, Matsumura? Uh, I'm fine. Ah, uh, shit. You've been bagged by a real creep, Matsumura. <laughs> That's right, it was on this very platform that two local high school students suddenly disappeared. They were helping a man who had fallen on the tracks. This isn't funny! He came home soaking wet! I'm sorry. I was going to meet him at a school, but I... Rain's very dirty. I'll have to wash his clothes separately. You've got to think about these things! Although I guess it's not surprising. The two of you are just a couple of good-for-nothing freeloaders, after all. I know that. So tell us, Taka, do the two My brother and that woman just had to run off to get ditched, didn't they? They just had to pop out a couple of fronts uh, and then up and die. But did it ever occur to them to stop and think about the first eye pack of air? We're having steak? I guess I'll go with 200 grams. I'm not feeling very hungry right now. Okay, you keep an eye on the house for me. Yes, ma'am. evidence, Taka? Actually, no. They're not even convinced this is a case yet. So, they're saying this isn't even worth considering as evidence. Masaru? That's my umbrella. <coughs> when I get paid for my part-time job, we'll go out for steak. Um, I like that umbrella. One of the kids at school told me that the AK looked really cool. So I told him just how you did it. I told him that you carved it with a box cutter. So, um, just where were you yesterday? 
Did you leave my umbrella in the subway? Is something wrong? An eyewitness described the first boy as being tall and muscular, while the second was of medium height and build, although a bit sketchy looking in appearance. According to the same witness, it was the sketchy one who dropped the adult magazine. It's being reported that the police are now using this information as a lead to help uncover the boy's whereabouts. Say what I think you said, you little worm. Huh? Oh, shit. There's no way out of this. Huh? 5,000 yen, right? No. I said 10,000, you fucking nerd. But what do you want me to do? What do you think I want you to do, huh? Stop yanking my chain. But I don't have that kind of money. Hmm. So get the money from him. Huh? But why should I? Hey, Matsumura, uh, here's the deal. If you tag this guy, I hit him up for the rest of the money. You understand? What? Uh, uh, huh? Uh, Colonel, I'm, I'm sorry, man. Uh, huh? All right, Matsumura, you're free to go. Uh, uh, oh, oh, hey! <laughs> you know... Class has started like I care, douchebag. But why pick on me? Your face. You got this look in your eyes. Bugs me. <laughs> See you after school, butt wife. With 50, bring me 50,000. Hey, what do you two think you're doing? Class has started already. <laughs> because of the look in my eyes? Shithead, my friend, you are not. Friends, huh? Uh, Chrono? Are you crapping? Uh, no, my stomach hurts. That's him, the one you want me to rough up. Yeah, that's him. <laughs> Why should I? I don't know, really. Something about his face just pisses me off. No kidding. Pisses me off, too. Why are they doing this to me? Hey, Takubana. I brought him with me. Who's that? I'm busy. Captain of the Karate Club. We hit up one of his students last time. I don't care what you punks do. Just keep your hands off our club members. <laughs> Did you hear me? Punk. Return all the money you took from our students. You hear me? This looks like my chance to get the hell out of here. Oh, what kind of fucking bullshit is this? Hey, you. The one who isn't a punk. You can go home. Oh, I wish I could be as badass as him. Oh, come on, get up. He was all bark and no bite. <laughs> what a pussy!
How often do you brush? Any cavities? Compared to the green onion alien, this guy is... Well, uh... I'm starting to get the feeling this guy is actually scarier. You got a big dumb mouth, kid. Now, try saying that again. Oh, come on. Say it again. Who is it that's not gonna pay, little bitch? Shit. Why can't I use this goddamn cosplay suit? Now that I'm thinking about it, those tits were really... Hey, why am I thinking about that now? At a time like this? Starting to work! You've got the wrong idea, kid. I'll fucking kill you! isn't a punk. You can go home now. Dude, what the fuck just happened? Oh, damn it. My hands won't stop shaking. Sure, 
<laughs> Up you go. Up you go. Up you go. Hey. <laughs> Up you go. <laughs> Haven't I told you to cut the engine on that fucking oh, bike when you're near the house? The neighborhood bit squad's been on my ass I again. You. I got you. What? <laughs> yeah. store and buy some smokes, okay? Get some milk while you're there. Okay, milk it is. Oh, Jesus. Uh, is tea cool with you? Oh, yeah, I'm easy. I would have been fine with plain water. Hey, no problem. I aim to please. So you live by yourself, huh? But, you know, if you would have just called me, I could have come by and picked up the ID at your place. Uh, hey, are you a little hungry? <laughs> Did I miss something? Foot in his mouth this time? Yes, I do. It 
makes you wonder just what he was thinking. Well, it seems he certainly wasn't thinking about the upcoming election, especially in light of his other recent actions. Well, yeah, I wonder if... Obvious he hasn't wonder been if what? About that for quite some time. I was wondering if I could guy? take a shower? A shower? I mean, uh, be my guest. The old hand been pecking at you again? Uh, not so much. Well, if you're not being pee whipped, then what are you doing out at night buying milk, you big pussy? Ah, uh, bite me. Hey, you punks! Huh? There are decent people trying to sleep around uh -huh. here. Keep it down! What's up with this joker? It must really suck being a biker with a wife. No, it sucks being an asshole. So! Do we kill him? Come on, Tetsu. Let's waste this fuck bag. Oh, shit. Oh! Oh! What, what the, the hell? hell? Whoa! Yes? Uh, uh, nothing, nothing at all. I just, uh... I'm gonna go out and buy us dinner and drinks and snacks and stuff. That'd be nice. to go. I mean, she did ask me to keep her like a pet, but what's that mean? Could it be just maybe? Tonight's the night I'm gonna score? But with a hot piece like her? No fucking way! This is too much! to this room comes out of something like a human fax machine. It's your big sister, Kay. She fell in the bathtub. We're all copies. The original really is dead. Don't worry. She's alive. She just regained consciousness. A human fax machine. She just regained We're consciousness. Copies. She's alive. Dead. Might. 
Toro rubbed his eyes and flew down the highway. Oh, you are the most precious thing. And then Ken went, wata ta 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 wata. And he said, you are already dead. The way I see it, the original really is dead. And everyone who comes to this room comes out of something like a human fax machine. So, Kay, now that we really are already dead, what in the hell do we do now? What can we do? Of course you pick now to look me in the face. I only bought Young Jump so I could buy the condoms. If you had cigarettes, you should have said something. Then I could have saved myself the trouble of going out to buy them. Oh, please, spare me the bullshit. If you want to go out riding, just say, hey, I'm going out riding. Here's your milk. Just put it in the fridge and it'll all be fine. just supposed to do nothing in a situation like this, or is nothing gonna happen? What do you want to happen? Uh, um, S E X. I'm your pet, Corona. Your pet. And owners don't have sex with their pet. What the hell does that mean? Uh, hey, um, you know, I used... 
used to have a dog back at home, and I used to give him lots of hugs and kisses. Virginities remained intact last night. So when will Gans call again? to know my opinion of most of these high school students today. They're nothing more than a bunch of good-for-nothing degenerates. Two punks disappear, and now that's all they can talk about. It's outrageous, simply dreadful. And I'd better not find out that you're up to anything strange like that. I refuse to let you bring that kind of shame down on this house. Excuse me. Could we please eat something now? What? Don't make me laugh! Do you have any idea why I made you sit down there? This little monster tracked mud on my carpet yesterday. It took me half the day to get it out, so why should I Stop tell you? it! There's no way that his socks could have been that dirty. Don't you talk back to me, you freeloading pups! <laughs> Let go of me! Why are you looking at me like that? Look, you can do whatever you want to me, but let my little brother have some breakfast. I 
told you to let go of me! Take your hands off me now! I'll let you go this time. But first, I want you to promise me that you won't ever hit my little brother again! How dare you! This is my house, and if you don't like it, you can get out! Hi, Yuki. Your brother's no good at all. What's with her? So, is this okay? What? You want that for breakfast? Well... You've at least got to eat some bread or chips or something. Look, it's only pet food after all. This will be fine. Well, it's not fine with me. Please, you don't have to. Don't worry. Do you have enough money? What? Corono, how are we supposed to pay for it? Aren't you almost out of cash? That was a damn good point. But she didn't have to be so harsh about it. Hey, don't worry, I've got it. Yeah, right. Could you show me the way to Hanodada? Which platform should I take? You! No fucking way! You can have these for free if you point me to the right platform. Where do I go? Just hold your questions, okay? There's no time. Huh? Time for what? That old bag. When we got called to the apartment the other day, she kept trying to talk to me. Didn't you see her? Huh? I think we'll be getting a call from Gantz soon. Anyway, we have to learn how to use these huh? so we'll be ready no matter what. <laughs> Corona? Uh, I'd really rather not look at your pail behind while I'm eating. Uh. Sorry about that. <laughs> hey, Grandma! Let me do it! All right, darling, if you think you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to do it. Here you go. <laughs> Grandma, which button do I push? Oh, my. Grandma! Oh, let's see. Oh. Well, oh, yes, that's the button right there. This one? Lady, I'm in a little bit of a hurry here. I'm sorry. We won't be much longer now, will we? Here, here, push this one. Oh, dear, you pushed the wrong one. Uh, Let's try again. What's wrong with that one? Um, why don't you let me give you a hand with that, okay? Where do you need to go? Oh, we're going to Hanoda Dye. Ah, okay. Then this is your button. Thank you so much for your help. Oh, no, it's my pleasure. Oh, dear, nothing's coming out. Grandma, you have to put more money in. Oh, goodness gracious. Hey, lady, move it. I'm sorry. I think they're almost finished. So, Tetsu, I'm thinking it's about time for me to get a bigger one. A bigger what? Bike, dipshit. When a biker says a bigger one, he means a bike. I thought I could break the engine in before the Hachioji race on New Year's Eve. Uh-huh. Hey, I'm serious, damn it! I didn't say you were lying, did I? Fuck, Tetsu, what's up with you these days? Huh? Since you had that kid, you've been acting like a pussy. Ah! Oh, shit! Fuck, man! What the fuck? What the fuck is your problem? I'll tell you what my problem oh. is. It's your big fat mouth, fat ass. So who's huh? the pussy now? Go on. I dare you to say it. Jeez, it was just a joke, Tetsu. Hey, Kosuke, I guess it's time we got off of Tetsu's old lady, huh? Yeah, but you know if he'd gotten off her a little sooner, he wouldn't be playing biker daddy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, asshole, what the fuck's wrong with a biker having a kid, huh? 
Yeah, what the fuck's wrong with you, man? <laughs> Calm down, Tetsu. We're just kidding. Hey, ladies! Break time's over. Get back to work. Yes, yes sir. sir. just fine. Wow. I bet those guys who go to those cosplay sites would cream their jeans over this. Uh, is there something wrong? Uh, no, nothing. But uh, you haven't worn one of these before, have you? Mm, no. Well, um, they're pretty important, you see. Because when you have one of those suits on, I think your chances of survival go way up. So you need to get used to wearing one. Well, how does it work? You, I'd be glad I didn't have to go. Yeah, but you only think that way because you can go. Can I maybe meet you somewhere after school's over? Could this be my lucky day? There's some place I need to go. All right, I'll go wherever you want. Dinner, a movie, or... <laughs> I just want to see the place where I used to live again. Huh? And I want to see how the other me is doing now. That's what she wants to do? <sighs> is that too weird? No, you're as normal as I am. You're not so bad. I'm sorry! I'm sorry! Well, you'll be worse than sorry, kid. So what should we do with them, huh? I got it. Let's pants the little bitch. Uh -huh. You heard me. Drop him. Now. But I said I'm sorry. Stop whining. It's not like you have anything ah! to show. Come on, guys. Don't do this. Please stop. Stop it. Oh, let uh -huh. me go. Huh? Hey, Kato. something about that 10th grader. Oh, shit, asshole. Well, then let's get to it. Today? Yeah, today. Let's hit him in the head with a bat and everybody takes turns wailing on him. Yeah, then we'll strip him down. Huh? Why would we do that? To shove the mop up his ass! <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, this guy have a pretty face? Oh, Onizuka! Hey, dude, this is the 11th grader's job! I could. Fuck his ass good. And I've shit wherever I please since the tenth grade. So just who is this motherfucker anyway? Oh, he's a real fucking nut job. The one who's always hanging out with the nerds. Huh. Oh, so he's the windy type, huh? No, he's fucking huge. I'd say the bastard's well over six foot tall. I tell you one thing, he doesn't scare easy, that's for sure. She his ass is mine. Count on it. Ha! <laughs> oh, man. Yo, cop 
got to, huh? We got business. Come on. So, what do you want with me? There's a bunch of 11th and 12th graders that are planning on jumping you after school today. And one of the 12th graders is a heavyweight boxer who just so happens to be queer. He says he's gonna fuck you. I thought you should know. Uh, Kato! Hey, are you all right? Of course. You sure? Oh, don't worry about it. Now let's get back to that game. When Philip II was assassinated, Alexander was crowned as king. Now, if you'll turn to page 34... Look, how many times do I have to tell you? I'm just not into chicks with large breasts. Oh, wow, he's gorgeous. What? You've never seen him before? That's Hojo Musanobu from East Setagaya High. Wow, he looks just like a model. Where have you been? He used to work for one of the top male talent agencies up until last year. Last year? Why'd he quit? Rumor has it that his agent wanted to do him. Ooh, yeah. I've always heard stories about stuff like that. Ooh. <laughs> It's just a book, nothing to get all worked up about. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to react like that. You can have the book. I was just looking at it. I didn't want to buy it. Here, take it. Uh, uh, no, I, I couldn't. Just take the book. Um, well, thank you. Man, you're jumpy. Is, is that obvious? Could it be? You're being stalked. How could you know about that? Well, I'm just perceptive about things like that. Well, I'll be okay. It just has me a little shaken up, you know? So have you informed the police yet? Not yet. But I think I may have to if it gets any worse, but I'd really rather not. Okay. Well, watch your ass. Are you really sure you don't want this? You can have it? No, you keep it. I find that the books you read are far more interesting if you read them when you want. Thank you, then. Oh. Hey, have you been waiting long? Not too long. So what were you looking at? Uh, never mind. Come on, let's go. What are you in such a hurry for? I'll bet it was a dirty book, wasn't it? <sighs> Ladies, could one of you loan me your bike? I'll pay you 10,000 yen. What? Um, my boyfriend's bike is outside, but what do you need it for? To ditch a stalker. She's right behind me. She won't leave me alone. She looks like the chick from the ring. What a freak. Okay, look, I'll try asking my boyfriend about his bike, but in return, can I sit behind him in class? Wait a second. Okay, okay, uh, that's fine with me, but it's not like a date, okay? Really? Oh.
So are you ready to go home, dear, with your new toys? Do I have to? time. It might even be tonight. Something special for you to wear tomorrow. Oh, Mom, this is so cute. It's getting a staccato. A new flirt. It's a very important day for you, dear. Thanks, Mom. I love it. Just remember, I'm counting on you to get a good score on the test. She'd have no trouble passing. We're all so proud of her. So, 
What do you think you'll do now? I don't know. But for some reason, I feel relieved. Huh? I feel as though my whole life I've been living for my mother's sake. Always trying to please her. Trying to be a good girl. I was always studying so hard. But there was no point to it. She never gave me a chance. Not once. So... In any case, I don't know what my other self is going to do from now on. But this girl here is just going to live her own life. And I'm in love. I've found someone I love. What? And I'll live for his sake and mine. All right. And I've still got plenty of condoms. This is Masaru Kato. Huh? I love him. I love him. I love Kato. Kato? Say, Kurono, do you know where Kato's house is? No, I don't. Oh. That's okay. I've got the feeling that I'll see him soon. Our destinies are now linked. Kato's in mine. He's the toughest. Yeah, but no matter what, it's still really wrong to hit people and stuff, isn't it? <laughs> Just because you're tough doesn't mean you can do whatever you want, right? Yeah. <laughs> you're right. What's with you tonight? Please don't die on me, okay? Um, uh, what are you talking about? It's just that... I want to live alone with you, so don't die, okay? I wonder if it hurt when Mom and Dad... I don't know. I've never died before. Hey man, no way these bitches are gonna hook up with us in a fucking alleyway. Oh yeah? Check out this email she sent me. I tell you, this girl's a total freak. And she said she'd bring three of her friends. Ooh, we all gonna get some. I know this bitch. She's pretty game for anything, so I'll bet you we're all gonna go home sore and happy tonight. Cool. Look, I'm out of here. My old lady's waiting on this milk. Oh, huh? come on, man. Forget that shit. Jump off. Oh, you'd like that, wouldn't you? I'd die. That's right. <laughs> what, what the hell are you doing here? You never noticed me. Oh, wow. Oh, shit. Jesus. God damn. What is that, a cat? It's been ripped apart. This isn't enough. I gotta go after something bigger. Oh, 
was that? No. I just felt a weird chill. Yeah, me too. Do you want me to turn on the heater or something? I'll be fine. Don't bother. So, does this feel good? Yeah. I bet your shoulders would get stiff. With these. Huh? What do you mean? With these what? I guess. I must have inhaled too much paint thinner or something. Why? I can't breastfeed the baby. I can't. Well, what about regular milk? That'll be all right, don't you think? Yeah. Deaf or 
or something? Yeah, tell us what's going on, you bastards. Um, okay. Yeah. It'd be pointless to explain anything. Even we didn't believe it. Well, I'm getting pissed. So start talking. Yeah, don't be messing with the boys. Hey, you. Mr. Pretty Boy there. Yeah. Well, say something. Sorry, I know Silch. You had better not be fucking with us. Fire. Damn, this is pointless. I get it. This is a hospital. We did get the shit kicked out of us. Oh, right. Does this look like a hospital to you? And none of us have a scratch on us. Hey, look at that. Huh? Huh? Whoa! <laughs> Check out the lungs oh, on her. Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh. Hey, we could still get some action. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what's going on here, but who cares? Me first. <laughs> I'm not taking sloppy seconds. What? Tiny dicks go last. Fine, you Look go at last her. then. She's all Be over Kano. I'm first and that's that. <laughs> Back off, assholes. Say what? Maybe you need a good bucket. Do ya? I want to go home now! I want to see my mommy! Shut up, you brat, or you're dead! I'm so sorry. Are you wrong? Think of something else. I'll find some way to get you home. Listen up! If you want to live through the night and get home, you've got to listen to me. I'll give you as much information as I can. Huh? You fuck! First of all, let me tell you the part that I know. That's enough! Soon, everyone here will get a weapon and be transported to a different location. Huh? Bull fucking shit! The dude's lost his mind. Maybe I have lost my mind. But that's exactly what will happen. Is this some sort of game? A reality show on TV? No, you're not on TV, and it's not a game. So what happens next? All right. We have to capture what appear to be aliens. Uh, dude? Aliens? <laughs> We've got to capture them. But aliens aren't real, Grandma. <laughs> this guy is out of his mind. The people who were here last time didn't take it seriously either. And all of them are dead now. Yeah? Well, where are these aliens? <laughs> I'd like to meet them. <laughs> what the fuck do we do now? Yeah, I am still lost. Who could possibly believe this? <sighs> you tell them, Kay. Tell them how the suits work. Huh? Well, there's really nothing to them. You just put them on. Huh? What the fuck is that? Sounds like a radio exercise show. happening huh your your lives are now over you bastards what you do with your new lives is for me to decide shit that clears it up we can go home now <laughs> <laughs> really? Really? Uh, wait it's changing uh, oh shit huh hmm. the suzuki alien traits Strong, refreshing, bird. Likes birds, sweets, catchphrase. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, this is starting to feel like a fucking video game. <laughs> Maybe we are on TV. Sweet.
shit. That's a fucking gun. <laughs> no fucking way they're real. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. I'm in love. Go ahead and change that. Don't worry, they're real, all right. It's your choice to listen to me or not. But these suits could be what determine whether you live or die. So who died and made Kato the class president? Nobody did. And it's not a position that I really want either. Then why are you spilling the beans? Because I want us to come back alive. I mean, all of us. You said we're like fax copies, right? Duplicates of the originals? And your point is... You are already dead, remember that? When I was growing up, I used to admire that kind of bullshit. But now... Now it really pisses me off! here what am i gonna do what am i gonna do god damn it okay one at a time go to the hallway and put on your suits excuse me did someone die and make you the boss no, not really, but I... But what? Maybe you should stop bossing people around, little Miss Fancy Pants. You think I'd wear this shit? Fuck that. Oh, please, ma'am. You really should put them on. I'm sorry, but could you tell us what we're doing here? Kato? I'll tell you once you're all dressed. You'll need the suits to survive what's next. Hey, Kato. Could we... Please put them on. But, uh... Like I said before, all of this Yamada alien stuff is fucking bullshit. It's Suzuki, the Suzuki alien. How can he say that with a straight face? But what's more important is my suit. Um, Kato? Oh. So, you're telling us that we all have to put on these suits if we want to survive. Uh-huh. But you also said you aren't the leader here, right? And what's your point? Well, I have to make sure these guys get home safe, you see? I guess you could say I'm their leader. The rest of you Nimrods can go to hell, but the four of us stick together. And I'm the one who decides if these three wear the suits or not. And the next time you try to order us around... Then you'll do what? I'll take you down before we do this Suzuki whatever. You got something to say to Tetsu or not? I'd like you to ask them to wear the suits. And that's not an order. It's just a request. Don't worry, I'll make sure you make it home safe and sound. Just wait a little longer, okay? Hey, Grandma, do you think this one's for me? Why, yes it is. They have kid sizes too. 
I just hope it's disinfected. You know how easily you get rashes. Oh, well. God, what a stupid old fart. <laughs> I told you, I'm not wearing that thing. Yeah, yeah, I get it. But maybe... You're not really gonna wear that stupid-looking thing, are you? No, but I was thinking... What if this wasn't a normal situation? Stop fucking with me! Yeah, all right. Look, I'll just leave it up to you guys. Do what you want. That's what I was planning on doing. I mean, what about you, Tetsu? You're not really gonna put it on, are you? You know that I'm not. Yeah, damn straight you wouldn't. You won't put it on either? I wouldn't be caught dead in something that gauche. Before long, we'll all have to leave this apartment. And when we do, what you're wearing will be the least of your worries. Forget it, I have an image to uphold. That girl with the big tits is changing. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> <laughs> hey, where are you going? You can't go outside, remember? We're going to the can. To take a shit. <laughs> See. I feel the dump coming on. Please, ma'am. Please put them on. Oh, I don't know about my grandson, but I couldn't possibly wear such a thing. Is not the time or the place for this. Holy shit, is she totally naked again? You don't believe this Sato alien bullshit, do you, Tetsu? It's Suzuki. Who the fuck cares? Well, from now on, you can just forget this bullshit about being our leader. I don't believe this alien shit. Come on. I didn't say I believed it, but still. When we get back home, I better not catch you riding around on our turf. I'm putting my clothes on top of the suit, okay? That's fine.
tell me you took it home. Uh. Too bad. What a shame. Your suit's gone? Well, I guess that takes one out of contention. Cause we've got one dead man already. Capsules? Well, look! Oh, yeah, right. You opened them yourself, didn't you? But it's not me! I don't care about the candy or the prizes! I'm telling you, it's a ghost! Yeah, whatever. <laughs> it's on the blink again. No way! Look! Over there! It's... It's from the last customer, right? Go ahead and ring it up. What kind of ghost would pay for its stuff and leave? I'm telling you, it's gotta be a ghost! Did 
you hear that, Mr. Let's All Make It Back? It's just bullshit! And you're still nothing but a hypocrite. Last time, you headbutted a Yakuza and nearly choked him to death, didn't you? Why would someone who wants all of us to make it back do something like that? Who are you kidding? They call those violent impulses, you know. Can't you use that thick head for thinking? Or would you rather just hit people with it? And you, tit girl. Me what? Isn't there something we can do? That kind of shit really pisses me off. As if shaking those money makers means we're gonna do whatever you say. Face it, a woman like you is as helpless as a little baby. You can't do anything for yourself, can you? But if you get in trouble, you can just wave a tit at him, right? That is what you think, isn't it? Isn't it? And you, Mr. Boner. Are you that scared of dying again? You ought to be ashamed crying like that. Remember how I thought you had a little bit of potential last time? I was wrong. You should be the first one to die. Why? And so what if I was afraid? I'm telling you, it's disgraceful. That kind of shit doesn't faze me at all. <coughs> hey, you little brat! <coughs> Shut up! I'm sorry, but do you think you could keep it down a bit? <laughs> you two are practically pre-filled body bags. You have no chance of surviving on your own. Oh, dear. You're just like Tits here. Dead meat for sure, unless you can rely on somebody else. And who will you depend on? It's not gonna be me, Grandma. <laughs> and since we're on that subject, you spoil that grandchild of yours rotten without thinking about the consequences. You think it's okay to warp his personality just because he's cute? Huh? You know he won't grow up to be a respectable adult, but that's not your problem because you'll be dead by then, won't you? So that makes it okay to let a spoiled rotten egg stink up society, huh? Am I wrong? Am I? And you. I bet you're the type all the girls go crazy for. But is there a single thing going on underneath that trendy hairstyle? Tell me, do you even know what the internet is? Have you ever used a cell phone for anything but chatting with girls? I'm not an idiot. No? Then let me ask you a question, smart guy. When you read a newspaper, where do you start? The TV listings, of course. Are you kidding me? You really are an idiot. Still, I guess you're better off than the biker trash. Those morons probably can't even read the paper. <laughs> what the fuck? So did you hit him? Uh, I don't know. It just made some weird noise. It doesn't matter if this stupid piece of shit works or not. I'll fuck you up. Stop Come waiting out. it around. No. Oh, shit. Ah! Oh, you didn't just fucking shoot at me, did you? Oh, man. That thing's just a toy. Oh, yeah? You just what? There's always a time lag. Don't you fuck with us, you little shitwad! Listen, assholes. That's what happens when you point a gun at me, got it? And what's more, I'll snuff you without a moment's hesitation, any of you! Imprint that on your tiny brain stems! And if any of you cretins slow me down, I'll kill you without a shred of remorse. Especially you. Look at that. She's relying on you already. I don't get it. How come nothing happened to you when you were shot? I'm not answering any more questions. Was it your suit? Dance! Hurry up and get on with this already! What are you waiting for? <laughs>
afraid from the get-go. Another one bites the dust. What? Chip, what'll I do? Okay, gotta think. How the hell do I get out of this? Shimoto, I'm gonna die. This is it. And I'm still up. What the hell is this thing? It's freaking me out. What the? Huh? What's it doing? Maybe he can't see me. Would I be a pussy if I just shot him in the back? What do I do? Will I even hit him? I can end this right here, right now. It's just a robot, no matter how you look at it. And if it's only a robot, if it's only a robot... What the hell? Bones? He has bones? This thing must be alive. What the hell do I do? I've never killed anything this big before. No, there's just something wrong with that kid. Damn it, I can't do this! What the?
I wonder where we are now. We're here! We made it outside, Grandma! You're right. I guess we can go home now. Wait. Wait a minute, please. Huh? Could everyone please come over here for a minute? Ah, screw you! We're out of here! Yeah, we've had enough of this crap. Stop right there. Uh huh? Do you think you're just gonna leave Kosuke's body there like that? Well, I sure ain't digging him a grave. Fuck him! Anyway, I need to run. I need to be with the others. Yeah, 
or whatever. Bring it on. He disappeared. I think I'll stick with you guys. shooting at I think that was Nishi just now wasn't it yeah I think so it looks like that robot can see him somehow <sighs> wow grandma did you see that stuff blow up awesome that time, huh? Yeah. Grandma, did you see? That weird guy just turned invisible. Yes, he did. That little shit. How come he can do stuff like that? I don't know. Why don't you try asking Gantz? Ask Gantz? What in the hell is that? We don't really know what it is, but it's one annoying son of a bitch. That thing is broken. He stopped disappearing. That thing could see him anyway, so I guess it really doesn't make any difference. Maybe it doesn't, but still. But still what? To hell with him. What the fuck are you all looking at? Help me out here! Hey, did you hear that, Haruya? Yeah, I guess he's the one who doesn't get it now, ain't he? Hey! Why don't you kiss my big fat ass? All we are is garbage, right? How can we help you? Yeah, we'd love to help, but we can't since we're garbage and all. Yeah, kid! <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, your little pea shooter's gone. So, what you gonna do now, you little piece of shit? Just shut up and help me out! Shut the fuck up! After the way you talked to us earlier, you could just stay there and fucking die! Die! And speaking of death, shithead, you told us that we're all dead anyway, right? So what difference does it make? You could just keep on dying and dying, right? So fuck you! Haruya, that's enough, okay? Shut up! You stay out of the- <laughs> oh, My fucking tooth! Tetsu, where the hell did you do that for? Man, thugs must really like knocking out each other's teeth. Hey, kid! Looks like this really isn't just a game, is it? I get the idea you're in a lot of trouble about now. But you did, in fact, blow Kosuke's fucking head off, and I hope you haven't forgotten that. You murdered another person. Give us a sign that you have some remorse about that. There's nothing more disgusting than a murderer begging for his own sad life. You hear me? Speak up! 
You're gonna apologize for murdering Kosuke in cold blood? Are you gonna show any kind of remorse for what you did? Say something! Come on! Wait. What? Are you really gonna help that little shit out if he just apologizes? And just what does that mean? Yeah, what do you mean? Surely you don't. Give me a break. He's just trying to save his own pathetic skin. The only thing that bastard's ever really given a rat's ass about is his goddamn score. Are any of you honestly willing to help out a piece of shit like that? Well, since I'm not like your indecisive fucking leader, this is about owning up to moral responsibility, his and ours. Do any of you, any of you, really understand the preciousness of life? How rare and valuable it is? Does it mean anything? You don't get it, do you? Look, I'm not saying that I'm gonna believe what he says, but at this rate, that kid's a dead man for sure. So, what now, huh? What are you gonna do? Damn it! <sighs> Now don't get me wrong, none of this means I'm gonna save the little murderer just because he apologizes. I'm saying I might consider it only if he does. He's treated all of us like shit, myself included. But even so, I'd help him, as long as he says, truthfully, that there's some remorse in his heart for all the rotten crap that he's done. Can you say the same?
I just want to go home now, Kate. More than any of you. But Kato can't shoot. That's just the way he is. And how he'll always be. I've never shot anybody either.
but I know I could do it if I had to. But Kato won't fire that gun. He can't. Oh, God. Did that sound cold and calculating? I wasn't trying to talk shit about Kato just because I want to nail her. I mean, it's not like I said anything bad about him anyway. I'm just saying, Kato is too kind a person to shoot. Yeah, that's it. It's true. You just can't shoot. our time here yeah let's blow and you if you got time to kick my ass why don't you go down there and help out your leader huh no don't go time for some ramen oh my fucking mouth hurts Ryota, i think it's time for us to be going home too. somebody please help him uh, are you kidding you want me to help you help him fine then Whoa, wait! I'll do it myself! I want to help Kato, and I'm sick of all you saying that I need other people to survive! So I'll go! I'll... Wait. I'll... go... okay? What should I do? Keep it at bay. Lacey! Lacey, can you move? My ears. I can't hear anything. At least these lights. But can I make it back over there? just happened down there? <gasps> it's Kato! <laughs> so, I wonder if they're all dead by now. Like I care. All I want to do is eat some fucking ramen. Ah, uh, shut your hole. Say what? Oh, yeah. You want to see a dentist, right? <laughs> anyway, what kind of dentist is open this late? Grandma, I really want something to eat. Of course you do, Ryota. All we need to do is phone your mother, and she'll be here soon to pick us up. We'll have her pick up a hamburger you can eat in the car. How does that sound to you? Is that all right? Yeah, that sounds great. Well, that's odd. I wonder if this phone is broken. Hey, kid, what the hell are you looking at, huh? Jeez, 
Hey man, you got any smokes on you? Nah, but those things will kill you, you know. Are you kidding me? Oh. Well, I'm motoring. Time for some ramen. Did you see that, Grandma? That guy's head just blew up. It's all, all over the place. Yes, yes, of course it is. <gasps> ah! Fiona, we have to leave! Ah! 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 <laughs> are you okay? <laughs> Are you okay? It's over now. Nishi, can you hear my voice? It hurts. It hurts. His ears are bleeding too. I think his eardrums must have burst. So now we go back to that room and get healed, right? Yeah, but the last time the transporting started right away. I don't get it. There's something wrong. I know. It doesn't make any sense. Maybe it's not time for us to go back. <sighs> but why not? You mean... Maybe there are more of them. Just like with the green onion alien. That's what happened then. <gasps> but how can we be sure? What about that radar device that he had? I bet that's it. He should still have it. <sighs> Damn it. No good. It's broken. Hold on, do you mean one of these? You mean you have one too? I was right. There's one more. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Kenji's head got blown off, but he didn't do anything. And he didn't even get near that fucking alien. His head blew up. So when you said we couldn't go back till we get the other one, Be broken. Cold. I'm cold. You're cold. 
Joishiro Nishi, 8th grade, and I fell. So you fell? I jumped off. From the... Gonna die? So soon. I'm not ready to die yet. Don't give up on life so fast, please. Never say you're gonna die. Never. That's right. She must understand how he feels more than anybody else. I never. I never hated anyone. Uh, I just hated society because. It's all fucked up. I always felt that I needed to stay on track. But it's all fucked up. That's why I can never stay on track. I don't want to die. Mom? Mom? to her. Mom, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, Mom, I tried hard, but... Oh, Mom, I'm sorry. Oh, Mom, I'm so sorry. Oh, Mom, I'm so scared. Mama. Mama, I'm cold. I'm so cold, Mama. Just wanted to hang on long enough. Just a li little longer. So close. So close. Hey, answer me! Is there any way we can get out of this? Shut up! How can you be so damn selfish while he's laying there like that? Look at him! Very bad. Oh, no, I... I'm actually getting used to this. I don't feel sick anymore. I'm not even scared or sorry when I see people die. Did you just say something? Are you all right? Yeah, it's nothing. This is Japan, right? And we're in the middle of a residential area. So why does it feel like a war zone? And what am I doing with this thing anyway? All I do know is I better make sure to hold on to it. If I don't, it's gonna be bad.
said there's more of them, right? Yeah. Hold on. Where'd the old lady and the kid go? Where did... They're gone! Oh, great! If Grandma Cena and her annoying brat run into an alien on their own, they're both going to be dead meat. Hey, cry me a fucking river! Why should we give a fuck about that old bag and her annoying little shit? Because it's right, and kids are supposed to be like that, you dumbass! Yeah? Well, why don't you shut the hell up? You're not the fucking boss around here! Or have you forgotten that Kosuke and Kenji got their heads blown off? And you couldn't do a fucking thing about it! So tell me, who in the hell do you think you are, asshole? <laughs> Just like the guns. I guess here even puking has a time lag. Bruno, that's not in good taste. How can you be the big man if you can't hold your lunch, huh? Go fuck yourself. And instead of talking smart, how about you give me back my tooth? Come get it, fat boy. Enough! If you want to be free from this, listen up! I'm going to try to find and destroy that other Suzuki alien, do you understand? And I'm going to try to find the old lady and the boy while I'm at it. And if any of you want to make it through this alive, then you've got to help me out! You said something before, about freeing ourselves from this. I think you mentioned a score. I don't know if that part's true or not, but we'll never find out unless we try. It's our only choice. To be straight up with you, I'd really rather not trust you with my life. But seeing as how that stupid biker got his head blown off for no reason... Just where did that happen? If you head back that way, there's a payphone that's covered with Kenji's fucking brains. That might be it. I get it. You die if you leave this area. It's about one square kilometer. But how is that even possible? You don't think there's a bomb or something like that planted inside of each of our heads, do you? And why would someone want to keep us here like that? Does any of this shit make any fucking sense? Unfortunately, I'm just as clueless about it as you are. What I don't get is how we're supposed to find two of those monsters in a square kilometer block in just an hour. Well, we did last time. But that doesn't mean we'll be able to do it every time. Then again, we do know that Nishid survived a lot of rounds before us. Ha! <laughs> that little turd! He took out Kosuke easily enough. <gasps> Look, the fact is that we have to find that other alien. And right now, we're wasting precious time. Okay, you're not wearing a suit this time. So I want you to stay somewhere safe. Uh huh? Ah, oh, look at her now. Just a minute ago, you were looking at me like you thought I was cool. Damn, you're flaky. Okay, Junior. Now you do what I tell you to. Huh? Not the oh. right answer! Oh. Oh. What the hell are you doing? I'll tell you what I'm doing, you dipshit fucking has-been of a leader. I'm taking your damn gun. God, that hurt. Uh -huh. Hurry up and hand it over. You're a worthless piece of shit, you know that? Hey, you! What do you think you're doing? Get back over here! Damn it. Where are they? Who? The old lady or the Suzuki alien? Either of them. Why don't we ask that taxi driver for some help? Because in case you haven't figured it out, we're completely invisible to everyone until this whole thing is over. So then, does that mean we really are dead? Now where in the world do you suppose we are? I'm hungry! I can't walk anymore! Oh, you poor thing. told you to stop! Oh, that really hurt! Are you crying? You make me sick! Ow! Son of a bitch! Start walking, kid! Move it! Hey, um, Kato? Is it true you can't use a gun? I really think that you should, just to be safe, you know? I mean, I... I know you're trying to do everything that needs to be done without them, but I just think that... If you'd pulled that trigger a little sooner, that kid would be alive. Think about that. That isn't what I was trying to say at all. So don't put any words in my mouth. I'll just say this. Females have stronger survival instincts. I don't think that's true at all. No, you're right. And I agree. But Gato... 
I have to be prepared to do it. Huh? It's close. It's gotta be nearby. But which one? Is it the Suzuki alien or the old lady and the boy? I can't tell. We'll know soon enough. Here they come. Huh? <sighs> Hurry the fuck up! Haven't you figured that damn thing out yet? This isn't mine, so I think it works differently. So if it were yours, you'd know how to use it. Not exactly. Stop your mumbling! Where'd that other fucking monster get to? This thing is only showing the streets along the river. How do I get it to show me the other areas? Hey, there's more now. <gasps> there must be more than one. It should be showing Kay and the others as well. Does the display show the river? Either way, he wouldn't be walking around on his own. So that must mean this dot is... Here it comes! <gasps> with your hands. What the fuck did you just say? If you miss with a gun, you're screwed. But your hands are a lot more reliable. You are nuts, aren't you? <laughs> what is it? <gasps> oh shit, how many of them are there? You know somewhere to hide you just bring that Suzuki alien on I'm going to tear that fucking freak's head right off hey you found it yet huh there it is but it's what spit it out this thing it's huge huge huh? so fucking what it's in there right go check it out you want me to go in there? That's what I said. Ah. Fuck. 
I could waste him, but what's the point unless we kill all the Suzuki aliens first? Damn it! So, this is it, huh? Yeah, I think so. Oh yeah, this is it. But, there's so many of them in there. Well, get your ass in there! Y huh? I thought you were gonna tear them apart, big man. Shut up! Get your oh. nutsack moving! Or I'll blow your fucking head off. So what now? Just wait. What the hell is wrong with it? Where'd the old lady and the kid go? I think they ran in that direction. That's not good. Then the other aliens are probably after them by now. Listen carefully, Ryota. I'm going to stay here. 
You go on and run out the back way. What about you? Uh, Grandma will take care of you, all right? But I don't have any clothes on. Go on now. Run. I'm stupid, you dumbass! You forgot upstairs! I said there's nothing here! You're the one who said there was a bunch of them shit for brains, so find them! Or I'll cap your ass! It's possible the machine could be broken. I've already told him there's nothing here! Final boss! There's no way I'll ever survive this. Am I gonna die?
Now what? Kato, you wait here, okay? Huh? What are you thinking? Without him, it's just you and me! You do know how to use these guns, right? But there must... There must be something that I can do too, isn't there? Please, just wait here, okay? I can't just stand here. I've got to do something. Hey, you know. Hasn't turned to face me. I still have a chance. I might just be able to get out of here. There's still more. 
There's no end to it. How long to go? There's only 15 minutes left. How many of us will survive this game? It's over yet. Yeah, but there's no way that can be. That thing must have been completely buried. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. What the hell is that? What is it, Kay? It's the final boss. What? What are you talking about? How the hell is that thing not dead? <gasps>
thing. Huh? You think I'm some kind of pussy, huh? Give me a fucking break! I'm done with this! Uh, Corona? I'll fucking kill you! So, it stopped counting down. Whoa! Am I going back to the room? I guess this is all that's left of us. Well, don't take this the wrong way, but I am glad you're still here. Perversions hey. and all. Can we leave now? for our scores. Scores? Screw the scores. So we're sitting here getting scored, but for what? If what that Michigan told us is the truth, when your score reaches a hundred points, you supposedly get to go free. <sighs> what the hell? So this really is some kind of game? Aw, another boob joke! It says 90 points to go, so... Does that mean I'll be free at a hundred? Oh! I guess that's five points each. Because I've killed two of them so far. What? I mean, you fought so many of those things. Yeah, I fought them. But unlike you, I only killed one of them. I get it. 
But the more you kill, the sooner you're set free. So I don't just have to survive. I have to keep on killing. Sadako? Who's that? Yeah. Her! She's hiding! Over there! Following the fag? Huh? So who here's the homo? Maybe one of the guys who died was gay. Uh, Let's uh, win. Uh, huh? But, hey! I'm not gay! I mean, give me a fucking break! Stay the hell away from me! I, I'll kill you! Yeah? Like I would even touch you! Uh. Yeah, right. Aw, come on, Kaku! So what if he's gay? But I'm not! I'm not gay! Oh, my turn? Hey, what's this shit about? Oh, what the fuck? Now how did he score so high? That's incredible, Kay. That's great! 38 points! But how? The errand boy? Me? I wonder where she's going. Well, I'm sure it won't be too long before we'll all be meeting up again in that room. So I guess I'll see ya. Uh, Kato? Um, you wouldn't happen to, uh, to live by yourself by any chance, would you? Uh, well, actually, my brother and I live with one of our relatives. Why? Oh, it's nothing! Really? I was just curious, that's all. Okay. Uh, uh, damn. Somehow, I managed to survive again. But right now, surviving kind of sucks.
thing. Uh, uh, it's uh, the final boss. <sighs> There's no way I'll ever survive this. Am I gonna die? Hasn't turned to face me. I still have a chance. I might just be able to get out of here. Oh, 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 oh. Are they 
taking so long? There's still more. There's no end to it. How long to go? There's only 15 minutes left. How many of us will survive this game? I don't think it's over yet. Yeah, but there's no way that can be. That thing must have been completely buried. Hallelujah! What the hell is that? What is it, Kay? It's the final boss. What? What are you talking about? How the hell is that thing not dead? Okay, it's 
coming after you! Go for it! No fucking way. Huh? You think I'm some kind of pussy, huh? Give me a fucking break! I'm done with this! Uh, Corona? I'll fucking kill you! So, is it over now? I think so. It stopped counting down. Whoa! Am I going back to the room? I guess this is all that's oh. left of us. Well, don't take this the wrong way, but I am glad you're still here. Perversions hey. and all. Can we leave now, or what? Well, I think we have to wait for our scores. Scores? Screw the scores. So we're sitting here getting scored, but for what? If what that Mishi kid told us is the truth, when your score reaches a hundred points, you supposedly get to go free. <sighs> what the hell? So this really is some kind of game? Aww, another boob joke! It says 90 points to go, so... Does that mean I'll be free at a hundred? Oh! I guess that's five points each. Because I've killed two of them so far. What? I mean, you fought so many of those things. 
Yeah, I fought them. But unlike you, I only killed one of them. I get it! The more you kill, the sooner you're set free. So I don't just have to survive. I have to keep on killing. Sadako? Who's that? Yeah. Her! She's hiding! Over there! Following the fag? Huh? So who hears the homo? Maybe one of the guys who died was gay. <gasps> Let's win. she's going well I'm sure it won't be too long before we'll all be meeting up again in that room so I guess I'll see ya uh, Kato um you wouldn't happen to uh to live by yourself by any chance would you uh, well actually my brother and I live with one of our relatives why oh it's nothing Really? I was just curious, that's all. Okay. Uh, uh, damn. Somehow, I managed to survive again. But right now, surviving kind of sucks. 